and over time I, I got to know my equipment far better than I did when I was working on the weekends. When you're troubleshooting over the phone or you're trying to come up with solutions on the go, you, you very quickly learn what, you, what your capabilities are and it was from there I just went, well I need to learn more about generators or I need to learn more about what my trucks can take and where they can go and um, even, even things as detailed as, as where can I send wide loads through Sydney? What roads do I have to take to, to get up to, to Newcastle with a, with a 6x3 site shed on? Or how, um, h- how, many, how many chains do you have to use on a steel plate? It's, it's all of those things that at, at 16, if you'd asked me, you, you'd go, oh, I don't even know what a steel plate is. What, is it, what, what would you use a chain for on that? But it's, it's, it's that growth and experience that comes with it that you can feel confident in making decisions um, and I, I noticed, <clears throat> the big thing I noticed with experience is that customers largely were telling me exactly what they needed and what they wanted and were giving me lessons over the phone. <laughs> As I was in the early days, they were telling me what, what they needed and describing things to me so I could, so I could understand. But I noticed in, as my experience grew and I, I felt more comfortable, I was explaining to customers the other way around as to what they needed and how they would need to get it there. And I think once I realised my the areas that I needed to to learn and 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 develop a deeper understanding that was when I started to feel more comfortable and mm. and and rather than go well I don't know that so therefore I can't help you just let's figure it out <laughs>